Mm. All right, we're back here in the kitchen hanging out with our main man, Chef Plum. How are you doing, Plum? I'm good, man. What's going on? How are you? I'm doing very well. It's good Excellent. to see you. Excellent. You have hey, freshly Teresa. done plum hair. That's good, right? Like, yeah, it's, it's bright. Good. I think it's when great. I get a cut, I look younger. Yes. No? Absolutely. She's lying. <laughs> You're always very useful. Where, where do you go? What, what's this? The oh, it's my friend Emily Taylor. Emily Taylor Hair okay. in Newtown. She's great. Shout out. There you go. Gotta shout her out. She's <laughs> awesome. No, she does a great job. It's funny because she puts up with me. And the best part about the whole thing is when she dyes my hair, mm -hmm. she's always like, should we get the gray out? I'm like, nah. I'll nah, leave it in there. It's, 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 I want to be the weird, the old, rainbow, bright looking guy. No. Who doesn't uh, love that guy, right? Okay. Uh, we're going to have a fun recipe today, you guys. All right. We're going to make something. It's a ricotta dumpling. All okay. right. Um, it's technically similar to, similar to something called a nudie, right? Not the, kind of, not the ones, the pictures you take at home no, in the mirror. No, I don't do that. No, 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 I'm not sorry. Well, it's even worse. How do I know that? That's right. even weirder. Oh, wow. Um, That's just getting but it, it's similar to it. So I had a client ask me to make nudie, hand rolled, right? Ha nudie is essentially the inside of a ravioli, okay. right? But it takes like 24 hours. What? So we couldn't do that. So I came up with this thing called a ricotta dumpling. Very, very similar. We can do it right away, super easy, right in front of everybody. You ready? Okay. Yes, ready. Let's do couldn't it. be easier. So we got about 16 ounces. Of dry ricotta cheese, right? Or, or Teresa, as the Italians call it, oh. ricotta. Rigot. Rigot. There's no ricotta. Stop it. Rigot. There is two T's in that word. Ricotta. That, that's there what you I go. Think. And then ricotta. you get yelled at by a It hurts my ears when I hear it. Stop it. Like Come, that. On that that Come on now. Come on. Come on now. Look, here we go. <laughs> right. So we get the cheese in there, right? Then we're yeah. gonna put about a quarter cup or so of Parmesan cheese, mm -hmm. a quarter cup of flour. AP, what happened? Nothing. I'm left right? Ryan. Yes. Right. Continue, AP flour. Please. AP flour. Mm -hmm. Okay. Also use double O if you want to be I really don't know Italian. What that is. Aren't you Italian? Double O. Yeah. Yes. Right. What's what double O? About? We're gonna use a little salt, right? Salt. Couldn't Olive be easier. Oil? And then we're gonna. I love oil too. <laughs> and then we also have these. You know what these are, Ryan? Those are eggs. Egg yolks. I was egg gonna yolks. have Ryan separate them, but the last time we did it, it made it challenging. A mess. It's yeah. always challenging. So we're gonna put to this in here. Right there we go. You use your hands for that. You were saying. You could. And now we're gonna have Ryan mix this up for us. Here we go. Now while that's happening. I'm setting. I'm nervous. Now you're good. Just go ahead. Just pop it in there. Well, you. <laughs> you kind of well, want to put it in, back. then turn it on. <laughs> nah, dude, this is how I roll. Oh, okay. I'm, so then what you want to do is I'm you want to take these guys and you want to roll them up into balls. Okay. You really mix it around. Oh, more. Roll them into a ball, right? Like this, into mm -hmm. some semolina flour, right? Okay. Feel it. You can feel it. It's kind of like, it's not like hard, but it's no. not soft, right? And I'm going to put them just right in this right. water, right? And they're going to take about four minutes in here, right? You're just boiling them? Incredibly easy. No, you're not frying them, no, right? No, no, no. Salted water, okay. right? And so what I would do is I would actually take them and put them in the, in the semolina flour like this mm -hmm. in our refrigerator. I'll show you what I did earlier. Okay. In the refrigerator. So you have them done. Just like oh, this. Oh, beautiful. Bird. You want them to sit in that semolina for as long right. as humanly possible, right? Okay. That's what you want to do. How's that going? It's great. You're going to mix the sides up, too. Right. No, it's, I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm getting right, easy. I you just, okay, I just we got to get them an apron. Jumping out of it. I mean, I come on the show. I try to teach you things. I try to, like, show you it's different hard, techniques. It's man. You think an electric mixer? Well, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, how long have we been doing this now? A couple of years. Yeah. And I'm trying to show you. And then I see you with the mixer, and it's really just hard. This is good, right? It's, how it's long just great. How long do you boil these, by the way? About four minutes. So let me show you what happens now. So what happens is that looks great, Ryan. Stop that, right? <laughs> oh, okay. Just okay. It's fine. We'll take two spoons, okay? We're gonna make something called a canal, right? A very, very French. So we're gonna take the spoons. You guys are gonna do it too. Spoon some up, and then you're gonna put the spoon like this. Yep. Now you don't have to do this. I'm just doing it so it'll be fun to to roll them, and dry right? And see how then we're gonna make different little angles on it. See that? Okay. Right? Oh, you fancy. Oh, you fancy. <laughs> <laughs> and we put it in there, and then we're gonna roll it up, right? It's so you guys try. Grab some spoons here. Okay. I wanna see if you can do this. All right? I just feel like making a ball. Here we go. Here we go. We're going to canal them up. Ready? These are nice little ones, too. All right, let's go. What's that? These are nice little ones. With the nudies? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Perfect size. There you go. It looks good. You want to get, get the angles on them? Oh, come on. How'd we do? You guys, there's a lot of people to feed here. This is going to take a long time. All right, looks pretty good. And what How's we'll do that? is now, now take we them and we'll push them, them onto, onto the uh, semolina. Right? Okay. Mine lost its shape. That's Why okay. did that happen? Because you're going to pick it up. Okay. And then you're going to roll it in your hand. Ready? Go for it. Put a little semolina in your hand. Little pinch, there you go. Love your nail color, by the way. Thank you. And then we're gonna pop that right in the bowl. How'd it go, Ryan? It was great. Yeah, it was, it was good. good. It was good. Is, that, is this one yours? Yes, looks that's great. mine. Looks so great. Thank you. Yeah, I worked really hard on that. Looks little great. Ball. Looks great. Now here's um, the fun part about these, right? And we'll, yes. Just to wrap these guys up. Yeah. The best part about this. And we gotta wrap it up too. Yes, yeah, so, but the best part about these, you can take these guys out, right? You can put them. They're bite size. On a plate, you can do more, uh, more, a lot, small, mm -hmm. big, whatever size you want. But when you do them, you can put whatever so, you know sauce you want to have with them, right? Okay. So like you can take these. So I've got a little. A little garlic sauce right there, a little garlic uh, um, velouté. Nice. All right, we'll put that on there. Awesome. Ooh. And we're going to have the whole recipe online. 100%. Make sure you check it out. Here. We got a scoot chef plum. You we got it. You. it looks Make beautiful. Sure you check Thank them out you online. so much for the nice Come recipe. On. We love, love it. Right? Check them out. Chef plum. We'll be right back. Can we eat?